This video will show you how you can use the Crime Analysis Toolkit to identify patterns in data using date attributes. So the Crime Analysis Toolkit is a free to download application that you can download from the CAD Corp portal. And once you've done it, it appears in the applications window and it has different functions that you can perform. So you can perform a timeline analysis, which is what we're going to do in a second. Um, you can also perform heuristic and you've got periodic and hotspot analysis as well. So each of my points has a, a date attribute on them that uh, will allow us to see how these incidents or um, crimes have occurred over a time period. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my temporal and I'm going to say I want to run a timeline analysis. So what the first thing that we need to do is select our overlay. So I'm going to select my housing data and then what we can do is specify the date or time column. So we've got a, a date that occurs with domestic violence and this is totally fictitious. Um, and then what we can do is specify a start date and a start time. So I'm going to say I want to see all the incidents that have occurred from the 1st of January 2015 all the way up to the 1st of January 2016. And what we could have done is we could have specified to say st um, automatically find the date and the time extents, uh, but I've just done this so you can see how it works. And then what we can do is we can specify the number of days that we can see. So we could do it on a daily basis. You could do it every um, two days or every week or every two weeks. What we're gonna say is that we want to run this for every four weeks. So I'll just move this to the side. And then once you've set it up, what you can do is click play. And play will automatically start showing you all of the different dates that occur within the uh, ranges that we've set up. So it allows you to easily identify patterns in the data using uh, a date attribute. And you can change the speed as well if you wanted to. So we've got this set as to one. But if you want to make it quicker because you're doing it on a daily basis, you can also change that to make it a lot quicker and identify patterns a lot uh, easier. 